Manipur observes 17th International Human Rights Day. Chief Minister N. Birain urges everyone not to abuse freedom of speech and expression. Congress MLA Kumuktam Joy Kishan slams Chief Minister N. Birin warns of disqualification under Indian Constitution Article 191 Clause 1B. MPCC welcomes 32 new members including veteran politician Okram Joy, veteran politician mocks New India promised by BJP as a fiasco. MLA Oinam El Radha Kishore expresses optimism about saving indigenous fishes found at Loktak Lake from extinction. And Deputy Chief Minister Yumnam Joy Kumar inaugurates 15th Sumang Leela Ningtham Kumhai 2018. Hello and welcome to Impact News. You're watching Primetime English News and I'm Premi Thangjim with the headlines and details. Manipur joined the globe in observing the 17th International Human Rights Day today. Manipur Human Rights Commission, United NGOs Mission, Human Rights Alert, Human Rights Law Network and United Voluntary Youth Council jointly organized a state-level observance at the Banquet Hall of First Manipur Rifles. Speaking in the event, Chief Minister Nongthom Bambirain stated that it is high time to enforce an act in the state for awarding befitted punishment to those bringing down the morale of the state through indecent and derogatory comments on just about any platform. Asserting that the government is there for ensuring protection of human rights and not to violate the rights, Chief Minister Birin called on everyone to respect one another. He reminded that even government employees and men in uniforms have human rights. He also said, if the government intends to do away with the rights of the public, it would not have set up Human Rights Commission in the first place. He urged everyone not to abuse the right to freedom of speech and expression guaranteed in Article 19, Clause 1A of the Indian Constitution, stating that the court has just issued an order and arrangements are underway to declare the recruitment result of police constable 2013 batch. The chief minister termed the bond imposed by certain individuals today as violation of human rights. He expressed disappointment that morality and responsibility seems to be diminishing among people in the state. He also urged those in executive, judiciary and legislative to cooperate one another to ensure that undertakings of various mission-oriented projects are not hindered. Biden clarified that the government is not asking the judiciary to always favor the government, but the government desires a joint forum to ensure progress in the state. Law and Legislative Affairs Minister L. Jainta Kumar and Acting Chairperson of Manipur Human Rights Commission Kaidem Mani also attended the event. Human right, human right, violation, human right. I think human right. I Minister I coin a tobacco than Angushi. Police not open at the human right violation. She am a hybrid at the human right violation over Missum, Natraka, me am a hybrid Tobuna, human right violation, Natragadi. But to balance with it. Sakar Piribani Hydena, I coin a low in a sum, numbered to wear. I coin the Matata, I look at Human Rights Commission, National Human Rights Commission, Law, Supreme Court, High Court, I quit the pursuit of wear. Similarly, Center for Human Rights and Duties Education and the Department of Law, Manipur University also jointly observed the 17th International Human Rights Day today. The event on the theme, Let's Stand Up for Equality, Justice and Human Dignity, was held in the lecture hall of the Department of English. Speaking in the event, 
Former Vice Chancellor of Manipur University, Professor H. Nandakumar, asserted that human rights are once bird rights and that they are laws against discrimination. He maintained that Center for Human Rights and Duties Education has been offering various diploma and certificate courses on human rights for years to raise awareness on the same. World Calendar of Universal Declaration of Human Rights 1948 was also released on the occasion. As a human being, World Human Rights Protection Association Manipur chapter also observed the 17th World Human Rights Day at Manipur Press Club today. Speaking at the sidelines, President of the Association, Mohammed Wahajuddin, stated that the day was observed to raise awareness about one's birth rights. Many people from minority community attended the event. I could give Pandam D. Muebukunida Amun Amabu, Pam the Tadoxing, Togandaba, Amadi. I won the Togan Indab Tadoxia, Topashing the Su, Equina, Ishana, Taudaba, Haiwa Colon, Pireptuda, Equina, Lemin Ragadi. Asumba, human rights violations, and she told you the Venia and Maram Moraganda, Punamoakanta, Minerasi, Haiwa Colonduda, Miam, the Messes, Pinanabama, the Kamina Nabogi, as you program us, Sinjavan. Chief Minister Nongthom Bambirain stated that agriculture, Kada, and minor irrigation departments will work together as a joint coordinating committee to enhance agricultural sector of the state. He said that lack of coordination between the line departments hindered production in the state. The Chief Minister was speaking during initiation of Rabi campaign come demonstration of farm machineries under the Agricultural Department at Naharu Makapad, Chandan Lokon today. We are in a short of various undertakings by the Joint Committee to make every paddy fields green post harvest. Kadagizuji, a minor Satariba, agriculture, a minor Pulaga Liba, Jagashi, the Kadasu, jointly Yoran. Madame Nikan, a minor, Ising Bido in Turinese in Kalaga, Turinese in Kalamatung, the Kenyan Masato, Gizikaran Tauduni. I look at Tauramatung, the Masak Hadoish in a Gizat Hadoni. On the high river of Humse, the Joint Committee, Seme, Yantoina Shoki, the Humi Tintoe, and the coordination, personal labor, Hore and other minor, I think. Kanabum Kangalam the Baitare. I don't have the Queen of Gomen and focus Piraci. Sing Labor Zagada, irrigation, canal Labor Zagada, low. Double cropping dog, whatever any Mahimarong Takadami. Irrigation canal, I'm the water source like them from the low way are with them in a Maduga Zagada, the Shing Labour Zagada, Putoga, the Wooden Hyber, a Koyam, the concrete of a portamalaponida. Sigi, Hunter Kisik and only a Koyam, the Salian Samogorin and Togoni, Mapamanga tried in the Fatore, other port hooks, Sidagina, Alugam Putore, Mamangi Topoga, Hantaka, Hangam Kam Putore, Hangam Tokam Toy, Logam Pokam, extra Putoponga Mido. Trial given a young get over. I do see now and the kids that came up with a success already. Matang the giddy, Bapan the gipus labor, Singagi Machinsa, Yen Gimachinsa, Ada Ginga, Pau Singam, Ada Gipore Iba, Siba with the Queen, Sarukara Gay, the Queen's the Gikan Trum, the Bonavita. Taking part in the event, Emily Nahakpam Indrajit loaded Chief Minister N. Birin for visiting and encouraging the farmers of Kitrigao constituency. Agriculture Department Director P. H. Rajendra also assured to monitor Chandam fields firsthand and make sure that Rabi campaign is fully implemented in the area. He appealed to the farmers to work wholeheartedly. <laughs> Company, <laughs> 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 <la
fifty fifty gumba koi taugen khali. Ado si natin na tapa koi integrated farming system si tenga yo piyari. Pedi kum piti kalsa taugen koi si tenga. Monitor si Bremen ay koi taugen na kanseri. Not only hoji ka hari bedunat tapa da koi na karib season da koi na rain nung next ki next year ki nung yutha si tenga koi si tenga pound pounds bi ay hybrid ay swabi koi asara ay bi methodu taurkan da koi potok si kaya miyano pound ki potok si hingal hangi haydo. Ado si changing tapa koi taugen season si ani magta koi na Nor only how I talk about the Nahui Alu, Sipishadi, and Tangi, Alu Mamanzi, Sarkana, who pay the people the Queen of Moydam, Nimasi, a Paisi, Sigisu, Tonga, the group of Semel and Semelaganda, subsidy type, the Queen of Hortic Department, Hajakanda, Alu, Sisu, Alu, 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 and one tiny Tangiban Emily Kumukchum, Joy Kishin, condemned Chief Minister Birin for failing to recognize him as a house colleague, Emily. He stated that Chief Minister N. Birin can be disqualified under Article 191 Clause 1B of the Indian Constitution for the same. It may be mentioned that in a news reporting of Times of Manipur TV channel, CM Birin failed to acknowledge Congress MLA Joy Kishin and responded to media query by asking who is Joy Kishin. The Congress MLA said the editor of the news channel has been already intimated to confirm the video clip which has gone viral on social media. Briefing media at his residence in Kuyathong today, MLA Joy Kishin expressed disappointment at the video clip which shows disregard for a fellow house colleague and hoped that the video is a fabricated one. The Congress MLA maintained that he will not file any allegation against the Chief Minister until the video clip is ascertained to be authentic. Shem Shibiri and Hari Ba Wapumado. I did Hazadi Man Hiram Nidri still. Hiram Bo Regadi, Masi Unsound Mine or Magadi, Article 191, the E. Basinati, Masi Emirate disqualified to Hunter. Magi Wapumna said the question Anybody, any legislature, Amana, Unsound Mine or anywhere in India, Indian Constitution, Makata, any legislature, Amana, Unsound Mine or Regadi, Masi disqualified to Wutham in a Grali Audi. Shibirin, Mana Rasiti, Kangling Ida, I give you Mamanga, Kabur. Harold told them, Kit Tabuk Dormariga, Kangagi, Magi election, Hanba Lepumatanda, Yamkana, I want to hide the Nai, Magi election donet or Colonia, Yamkanda, election Walla, who I donet. I do Matunda, Ivania Dumri lesson, Paitine, Mana Pontro, Pusago, Imung, the Haina, as Birian Pontro, the Mike, and no problem, only in this minor dinner life. I still respect him. Altogether, 32 individuals, including veteran politician Okram Joy, former Vice President of BJP Manipur Pradesh A.R. Khan, and former Oripo constituency BJP candidate Dr. N. Dvijamani, were accorded a warm welcome by Manipur Pradesh Congress Committee today. MPCC President Ian Haukip, CLP leader Okrami Bobi, and CWC member Gekangam, and many Congress MLAs and party leaders attended a reception ceremony held at Congress Bhavan BT Road. Speaking in the event, veteran politician Okram Joy criticized the BJP government as a corrupted one. He rebuked Prime Minister Narendra Modi led central government for not keeping its promises of making India a corruption-free country. He further alleged the Modi government of trying to suppress the freedom and power of press. The veteran politician mocked that the new India promised by BJP government as a fiasco. Ojoy intimated that he left the BJP for being unconstitutional and undemocratic. The veteran politician said instead of retiring from politics, he joined the Congress party to correct the situation at hand. Matamamada si Narendra Modi na lapaganda man haya, Congress party 10 percent. Pujikti ay na muhay ba yare, Narendra Modi government 30 percent, BJP 30 percent, karibu kanda na 50 percent, BJP government tangkai jali, BJP na Jalai Vya Sarkar se ngasi baru ta sabjana undeclared emergency lao to inel. Annual Democratic Index hana 30 wanda lai rambat of jik, 40 wanda hai dakre. Democracy da praise ki maning tambahe se lai tarka anda di gana tantai si lai tarka gumbani. Aduna hana freedom of praise lai rambat se sigi thak taki ho jik ti aada 172 adai da hai dakre aba. External Affairs Minister, State Independent in Charge and former Army Chief General V.K. Singh has arrived in Fall on a two-day visit today. 
Briefing media at Imphal International Airport, VK Singh stated that visa on arrival facility is provided in many countries and some countries even provide the facility on bilateral arrangement. The union minister intimated that he will be visiting the passport office at Old Assembly Building and highlight on the benefits of visa on arrival facility. We have already done for a lot of countries. See, this is a bilateral arrangement. When we give visa on arrival facility, that country also must give. So this process is on. I'm quite sure everything will be okay. So that's why I said it is in both the countries. So till the time that country doesn't agree, it becomes difficult. Horticulture and Soil Conservation Minister Thong Nau Jim Shyam Kumar today inaugurated three retail outlet markets constructed under Mission for Integrated Development of Horticulture, MIDH, Central Scheme under the Ages of Horticulture and Soil Conservation Department, Government of Manipur. A retail outlet market was inaugurated at Tumukong Village under the Andro constituency in Fall East District and one eats at Island, Risopung and Island Block of Cycle constituency of Kangpokpi District. Speaking at the inaugural function of Tumukong Village, Minister Shyam Kumar said that the retail outlet market inaugurated in the last village of the Andro constituency located near Thaubal Multipurpose Dam will surely benefit the market as it is located between Pungyar and Saikul constituencies of Ukrul and Kangpokpi districts respectively. The minister advised the villagers to cultivate seasonal crops and plant organic vegetables so that paddy fields are not left barren post-harvest. Minister Sham Kumar disclosed that a shopping complex has been proposed for Island Village under Tribal Affairs Department. <laughs> Members of Airports Authority Employees Union Imphal Brand states sit in at Imphal Airport today against privatization of Guwahati, Ahmedabad, Jaipur, Lucknow, and Trivandrum Airport. Speaking to media, Secretary of Airports Authority Employees Union in Fall Branch, Kwairakpam Surachandra stated that the relay hunger strike which started today will continue for 12 days. He said that the strike will continue until the demand is fulfilled. Private the pitopo have si koi da mangwa yamna state kinet traga koi gi airport authority da yam yamna mat mangwa saong na mangze wa malay airport authority have a the tanking sangstana se mini ratna kita guli da sali ba dugu ba maratna phangna na ba kanna profitable industry yam da sali ba lamni tuongi ba airport taru kasi yon thokar ga dia koi gi profitable du kamai na laaga koi gi staff ching da kamai chala hai ogadu ga ya da koi asi bo da khan ba da kangao na airport asi sung pi pitopo ya de ha na khara pi gre pi khara ga su si koi kona singa abni na matung da koi sung pi pi ba ya ro hai na koi Normal life in Imphal City remains unaffected by the 48-hour total shutdown called in the state by JAC of All Manipur DPC completed candidate of police constable meal 2013 batch. The ban commands last midnight was called against non-declaration of recruitment results of the batch. Traffic remains active in the heart of Imphal City despite some lakes in other parts of the state. Business transactions operate as usual in major markets of the city. On the other hand, vendors of Kwaramban New Market closed their shop today demanding IMC to enact proper rules and regulations for street vendors. Some shop owners intimated impact news that the ever-rising number of roadside vendors bring negative impact on their business.
Kau ni street vendor cinga sih. Ayuk pung nipan bu paman biraga. Pung bari dekik na an nung dangbo tu pamsi seno moy. Kacau kaya di atai matam di moy paman biri no. Kaya dan lengah kiri, kaya kiri asal wasang, kaya kiri mukai cinga sih dah, kaya kiri street vendor pamsi pun moy cinga sih. Mungkin di lokasan biu, nanti lagi dia kaya pulap si mina batar eh. Kaya bersih kaya kiri dukan pamsi riba cina lok cinga sih kiri. Maikai dekik moy cinga raga. Tuli Hill Battalion of Headquarter 9 Sector some rifles under the aegis of IGAR South installed and handed over 10 solar street lamps on the request of Malum Gram Panchayat as a part of Operation Sav Bhavna project today. Over 150 villages attended the event where Commander 9th Sector Assam Rifles Brigadier Ahmed Kabdiyal handed over the solar street lights to Pradhan of Malum Gram Panchayat. Brigadier Ahmed Kaptiyal has assured of more welfare projects for the people of Manipur. Two ex-servicemen of the Indian Army were also felicitated on the occasion. The villagers expressed gratitude to Assam Rifles and the Army for the kind gesture. As we are all aware that Assam Rifles and the Army have been deployed in Manipur for a very long time and it is part of our operation that we are carrying out here that we indulge in such projects of goodwill wherein whatever is the assistance, little assistance which we can provide is done through this project. And I am very glad that such a request had come to the battalion because this shows the trust which the people have in the army and the Assam rifles. And it is, it will be always our endeavour to help out in whatever little way we can towards uh, uplifting the localities which are here and to as a small gesture of our contribution towards the overall development. And on that note, it's time for a small commercial break. After the break, we bring you news on the inaugural of six newly constructed cage aquaculture at Taubul Yangoi Karong. Keep watching Impact News. Welcome back after the break and you're watching Prime Time English News. Emily Oinam, Assembly Constituency, come Chairman of Manipur Pollution Control Board, L. Radha Kishore, has expressed optimism about saving indigenous fishes found at Loktak Lake from extinction. He was speaking in the inaugural of six newly constructed cage aquaculture, jointly constructed by Loktak Livelihood Mission and Symbolic Enterprises at Taubul Yangoi Karong near Loktak Lake. Emily Radha Kishore assured that the state government has undertaken various projects with a vision for high quality, better growth, more profit to save indigenous fishes at Loktak Lake. He urged fishermen in the area to cooperate in ensuring success of the project. Scientists of IBSD Imphal, representatives of symbolic enterprises and many people in the area attended the event. And how do you get the battery to 100 years ago? I don't know how to get the battery to 100 years ago. I don't know how to get the battery to 100 years ago. I don't know how to get the battery to 100 years ago. I don't know how to get the battery to 100 years ago. Deputy Chief Minister Yumnam Joy Kumar has inaugurated the 15th Shumanglila Ningtham Kumhai 2018 at Shumanglila Sanglin Palace compound today. Speaking in the inaugural event, Joy Kumar stated that Shumanglila still rules the hearts of many. He asserted that Shumang Kumhai gives valuable messages to the public through depiction of both good and evil in the society. Chumthang Creative Artists Association Sumang Lila Imagi Yathang was performed in the event. I ask you, Maki, theatre, you didn't come to cinema, you didn't come to Amagini, 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 you didn't come I know some young with the day, Sigi Matang the day, Sumang Lila Council the day, Adiam Kan Hakna. हाई रिपोर्ट कौन होगा ताना वो कौन होगा दही बिदी नत्ते जुम्ना उन्हें बता अधूम हाई बगी मोंग जो नितोई अधू वो दाई ने कितने थम्जनिंग से हाई वे सुमांग लेला काउंसिल की तोरी वो कोली बसे इट कैन सरवाइव इट कैन एक्जिस्ट ऑन इट्स ओन सिगी हाई बेट सो आप वहाँ ऊब पंगे अधू के लोइने लोइने 
the three-day-long 15th Orange Festival held at Taming Long District Headquarters concluded today. Speaking in their concluding event, PHED Minister Lucy Diko wished the people of the district Advent Christmas. Start stating that railways will reach Taming Long in the near future, he urged the villagers to promote orange production. Farmers producing the best oranges were felicitated with cash prizes on the occasion. Chanura Microfin Manipur will provide loans for those who cannot afford to construct sanitary toilets. Nabat, Manipur Regional Office Deputy General Manager R. Ravi launched a toilet building loan loaning scheme at Cookie in Imphal today. Speaking in the event, Chief Executive Officer P.K. Kuman stated that the initiative was undertaken with an aim to build a healthy society. He said, loans will be provided to those who have financial constraints but are also deprived of various toilet building schemes of the government. He mentioned that 400 individuals will be provided a loan of 30,000 rupees each during the first phase. Hireable loan as a friends of women wall bank in Diaga Kusam Narga, a quick lamdam sigi, Ima evil sing Kayamada, a queen of Pina Bogeda Makta, Nasi, long stock Germany. Masi, a queen of Hose Hose Manipurgi, Tongan Tonganba, a quick mapam sing the labor, Gamanke, Skim Pangba Nataba, Aduga, Amusu Masana, Savangam Basunataba, Marak the labor, Adumba, Ima evil sing to the Aquigi, Sentangzi, a quick pizza gadabuni. Masida, a queen of face nine, a queen of Pantuk Sagani. Center for Study of Social Exclusion and Inclusive Policy, Manipur University, held a one day lecturer program at the center's lecture hall today. PhD scholar of the University of Minnesota, USA, Robert Osborne, gave resourceful insights on religion and development of nations during the program. Manipur Science Communication Maska organized the 20th Millennium Science Lecture 2018 at regular Nobel English Prize, High Nobel School Prize, in Kwakaithil, Hainau, Kumnambi today. Science experts gave resourceful insights on the subject in the event. Retired Principal of DM College of Science G. Thomas Sharma, Master Director T. H. Surendra Nath and Chairman of regular English High School L. Birain graced the event. District Administration, Bishnupur and Social Welfare Department have jointly organized a one-day sensitization come training program on child protection and Beti Bachao Beti Parao at Panchayat Resource Center in DC Complex, Bishnupur today. Discussions on crime against women and children and on education of women were held in two sessions. And in sports news, the overall champion of the 52nd Mr. Manipur and 7th Mr. Kamba Bodybuilding Contest, Laiton Jim Rishikanta was accorded a warm reception by residents of Patsoi Part 4 today. Rishikanta, son of El Manoj and El Indira, backed the title of the contest organized by All Manipur Bodybuilders Association on December 2nd. It may be mentioned that he also backed Junior Mr. Asia and Junior Mr. World titles last year. AMBBA advisor N.K. Gojendro, Manipur Adventure Forum Vice President Dr. L. Surjit, Amba President and Ratan, his mentor in the field of bodybuilding, Kangle Bodybuilders, Jim Tera Sapam Leirak, Chief Coach, as Joy Chandra and many eminent persons attended the event. Rishikanta grew up as a Natsankritan singer and put his best efforts in bodybuilding. He appreciated his family, teachers and well wishes for supporting him unconditionally. Kanglai bodybuilders Jim Tera Sapamleda, chief coach, as Joy Chandra urged the people of the state to encourage Rishikanta for all his future endeavor. I call Jimashida, they are bodybuilding pubs or Sanoching Shawyavu, I call Emil Sanikat Natana, Mavi trainer, the manly, 
Manipur Student Olympic Association in a press release informed that a state level selection trials for selecting football players to participate in the upcoming fifth Students National Olympic Games will be held at SCK Ground Kodompok P. Mamang from December 14 to 16. National Olympic Games is scheduled to be held in Manipur from January 10. Interested footballers can avail further details from MSOA office in Sega Thauda Bhabok Lekai. Before we end the bulletin, let's take a look at headlines once again. Manipur observes 17th International Human Rights Day. Chief Minister N. Birin urges everyone not to abuse freedom of speech and expression. Congress MLA Kumuktam Joy Kishan slams Chief Minister N. Birin warns of disqualification. Under Indian Constitution's Article 191, Close 1B. MPCC welcomes 32 new members, including veteran politician Okram Joy. Veteran politician mocks New India promised by BJP as a fiasco. MLA Oinam El Radha Kishore expressed optimism about saving indigenous fishes found at Loktak Lake from extinction. And Deputy Chief Minister Yumnam Joy Kumar inaugurates 15 Sumanglila Ningtham Kumhai 28.